let's take a look at something we can do with evil portal. In this situation, I want to create my own SSID. I'm not going to copy one. I'm not going to use one from a file. I'm going to create my own SSID and project that, connect to it, and a splash page will pop up and I'll show you how to do all that. So the first thing we want to do is we want to go and launch Marauder. So I've got Marauder launched. I'm using an ESP32 GPIO board with Marauder loaded as the firmware. And then I'm launching Marauder on the Flipper Zero. What I will do is go down once I've launched Marauder and I'm going to create my own SSID. And I think I passed it. So not add random. So we can see here SSID. I want to scroll over to add name. So I'm going to add name. And let's just name it whatever I want. Whatever I want right now. So that enters the command in, hit save, we can see it did it. Now I want to pick the HTML page that's going to load. So I go to load evil portal HTML file. I have all my HTMLs already saved in the appropriate place. For this test, let's do Microsoft. Boom. The HTML set, the SSID set. Now let's launch the SSID. So we just go to Evil Portal Start and it'll tell me, hey, we're starting the AP right. It didn't have now, but let's see what happens. And it gives me an IP address. So it should be projecting that. It should be displaying that. Let's see what happens here. All right, so we're in Wi-Fi. Oh, so it doesn't do... The space, that's interesting, did not know that. So if I click on this now, oops, wrong thing. If I click on it, bam, let's see if it launches a splash page. So it connected me and there's my splash page. Now, if I enter anything into this splash page, let's enter something and password is now. So username is right, password is now. I hit next. And let's see if anything popped up here. Username right, password now. Username right, password now. So if I do that again, and I type a username and then a password, boom. So I just typed all that in. Let's see what comes up here. Username any, password, very good. So using the Flipper Zero and a ESP32 GPIO board, I was able to create my own SSID, associate a, an HTML splash page to it, connect, then have that splash page come up and read credentials. You can even save the information you gather into the SD card of your Flipper Zero.